Well, hello guys, <clears throat> Darkness Explorer here, and I'm a little bit sick, but Death Battle, um, yeah. Uh, Leonardo versus the Red Ranger, it came out, it was alright. I would save up my feelings about the episode at near the ending of the episode, or right after this prediction, and I will talk about the rest of the episode later. And if, and, yeah. I might put time frames so when I'm talking about the episode the uh the episode just came out today. Maybe. Perhaps. But in but in reality, probably not. But okay, so Generalist versus War Machine. This is a kinda I don't get the comparison, maybe just get their sidekicks to decently powerful characters. I think like, like that's the closest thing I could see for them. Well, as as a comparison, I mean they have they have like explosions, or yeah, I don't know. I don't know why they made it, making this fight. It, the premise is not the greatest, but like whatever. But as power wise, I would honestly say, or who's gonna win? I might give my money to <laughs> not give my money, but like I would. Power is very, very going to be tough for these characters. But, uh, like, Genos, when, okay, we're, we're going to do some scaling to other characters in their verses. So, with Genos, we can scale to other uh, S class heroes, mainly because of the fact that um, his, one, of her, one of his newer models was able to uh, keep up with uh, partially, uh, partially awakened Garo. Who is much more powerful, well, basically implied to be more powerful than a live, or not a live, but it's the, um, uh, human Garo, or just normal, just base. Mainly, like, in base Garo, where he's just a human and stuff, he's decently, I mean, he's a, no, he's a pretty, he's a pretty powerful chap, not gonna lie. He was able to, but he he just went by his goddamn dick and like clapped the tank talk uh the tank top ma uh tank top master an S class hero who according to the hero association S class uh one S class hero equals what uh, a demon level threat. Well that's what they generally assume but let's just take that. Let's take that. And let's just wank him at, at, let's just wank these S class heroes to be city level, all right? Because demon level is in the source material is when it, when a monster is a threat to a city and its people. And we're you know we're winking these you know we're, let, let's just let's well, let's just jack it off a little bit that statement. Well, yeah, basically, and so they're city level, and Garo shits on a sh a, a city level character. And uh, some goons, but they're not really important. He 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 shits on them, right? And he shits on another character, Metal Bat, who yeah, he, he basically shit on uh, who stopped a full frontal attack from Elder Centipede, who is and I uh, and I quote a dragon level threat. And if we're going if. Well, not stopped in a... Uh, well, slowed down a full frontal attack, I'm pretty sure. I don't know if he completely stopped it, but he... He went to that motherfucker and, like... He attacked and they collided. And he didn't fucking die, so... Eh... Get that... Get that state... Uh, from that quote for... Um, I don't know. Fucking hell. Uh, so, if we... You know, we're... we're okay, let's just wink this feet. Let's just... Let's just Dead ass shit right now, alright? We, that is... We could probably say that's multi-shitty level. Probably, not gonna lie. That's pretty damn fucking impressive. And let's see who... Okay, multi-city level. This is Metal Bat and Human Garo. We're, you know, we're waking these characters right now. And... For, um... Partially awakened Garo is much stronger than this girl that was fighting Metal Bat. So, 
Yeah, this is an interesting one. So, yeah. And with this, Genos obviously scales nearer to Garo's level, but not completely. But he does scale. He just does kind of scale to this kind of wanked feet right here. But like, now we're now we're going now we're going to the now we're going to meet to the bone war machine's power and let's do some scaling because we were just wanking off generals at the moment so let's wank off let's let's kind of wank off this day. let's 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 wank off war machine by a bit uh let's scale him to i uh we could possibly scale him to iron man because of the fact that his suits his uh, war machine suit is comparable to him and like i think just going off death battle that's what i literally said in one of his one of their videos but i don't remember they have enough oh i think it was in this black widow's like oh yeah a guy with enough power, like weaponry to destroy an entire city so take it with that but we could honestly because there's been so many feats and uh there's like comics are just bad shit insane and like there's arguments for Wolverine, who is a who pop output wise is probably weaker than Iron Man and War Machine. Not involving the claws, but like just pure destructive capacity, has been literally. If you wank him off a little bit, Wolverine, he to city level, and these two and these two and these two Iron Avengers, literally. Are literally more have more destructive cap cap uh, or I don't know. This is just getting confusing, but like honestly, we could just literally say that Iron Man has destroyed mountains before. I'm pre I'm pretty sure there was a comic that he destroyed mountains. Yeah, we could just literally just say that. So yeah. Iron Man, uh, War Machine outpowers Genos by a humongous margin via being mountain level. I mean, I mean, we could, like, if you really want to argue, we could wank him to the fullest extent, like, like, we're beating this motherfucker up, right? Like, we kind of did with Genos. We could probably put him to planetary. Yeah, that's like, that's like heavy being, like, you're like, it's like Chris Brown to Rihanna beating at that moment. Like, to me. That sounds really fucking bad. But still, that's like... Mainly because of the fact that, like... Grey Hulk? I mean, a, a Green Hulk... A casual Hulk is, comp is comparable... Uh, is a bit stronger than Iron Man. But not that big of a margin. Well, this is him not, like... Going, oh, I'm gonna fuck everyone up moment. But it, this is more of a, oh, well, I'm gonna just, I don't know, just, I'm just angry moment. You know, he's not gonna, he's not full, he's not fully developed as a massive fucking Chad. This version of Hulk is stronger than an older version of Hulk, aka Grey Hulk, who destroyed a meteor that was, that was twice the size of Earth. Casually? And this is not looking good for Genos. And even if we say that that Iron Man is like heck, heck, we can just say like Hulk is just baseline planet level. Like this is Hulk. Hulk is casually planet level. Let's say he's when he's just calm and casual. He's weaker than he is weaker than Gray Hulk, who who is lar which is roughly planet level plus to large planetary. And let's just say that he's. Mm, uh, they just say Hulk is baseline planet level. Just, just you know, he could destroy a planet, or even like maybe we can say a, he could just destroy a continent. Or let's just say yeah, planetary. Let's just leave it like that. We just cap it Hulk right there at baseline. Hulk is baseline uh, planet level. And if we say that Iron Man, which and with an extension to War Machine, is at least one one thousand one 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 thousand. I have a fucking list for some reason. One one thousand, one one thou. I am now mad. One one thousandth of his fucking power. God, what the hell is wrong with me? He is. He's he's packing some package right there. 
That, that, that's like David Bowie shit right there. That's some big ass package. So, yeah, that's War Machine. I mean, we. I technically both. I'm whacking both of these fuckers off. Like, I mean, I'm going full on mode right now. Uh, speed. By the way, this is just me wanking everything. This is not me taking shit serious. But who who knows? Who fucking knows? And then, now we're going for speed. And speed is just, holy crap. This is just, ugh. Ugh, God. Okay. Street level, uh, let's just say this. Just casually, uh, certain characters around, around War Machine is at high, massively hypersonic to FTL speeds. Yeah, I'm not kidding. Characters on, uh, characters on War Machine level, uh, War Machine's level, and that, and characters that he has fought, mo- uh, a decent margin to do scale to other characters. It's like a lot of scaling and shit. And like, I can't get like exact because I'm pretty sure so many characters on this level have dodged lightning and lasers, and some of these lasers, sure, they're they're not as fast as actual light. But the but there are other lasers that are literally in in that there are literally stated to be fa- that uh, be the speed of light or literal lasers. <laughs> and, and it's a lot of confused shit right there at the moment. And then here comes Genos, who with the higher scaling, you know, we're we're also winking, we're also doing to him too. Probably at, probably speed of light to maybe FTL because. Right now, we're scaling him to light, to, uh, Flashy Flash, who stated that his attacks should be faster than light. And he is the fastest hero, I'm pretty sure. Well, if we're excluding King, well, Hype, Hype, uh, not King, but, like, uh, Blast, or, because we don't know how to power Blast, or Saitama. Like, Flashy Flash is saying light speed, and even if we say, oh, Genos is faster than him, surprising, faster than him, which just doesn't make sense, since Flashy Flash is obviously faster than Genos. Well, let, let, let's just say Genos is faster. So he's FTL. Boo hoo. War Machine is also FTL. And that's just pure scaling. We're not, you know, we're not doing, uh, fuck. We're not doing that shit to him. With, we're not doing that shit to him. Because if we do that, we could probably make a good case that he's FTL plus to really roughly moving at much faster speeds. It's just. It's just wrong, bro. It's just, it's, War Machine comics are just sometimes more stupider than fucking anime when like power and shit. And durability, their uh, Genesis durability is probably weaker than his own, weaker than his power output, mainly because of the fact that like he's very breakable compared to uh, and he's very breakable. But like, let's just give him benefit. I just, I just fucking say that he. He's as durable as how much power he could dish out, which, which we if we do him, he's probably massively. He is multi city level, and War Machine is just mountain level. Yeah, I could have just come up with that, and that shit came in on my screen. So yeah, that's pretty epic. And with that skill and intelligence, it doesn't really matter at this case. War Machine is faster. Well, I mean, boo hoo. Okay. What? Okay. Genos might be. Even if we say Genos is smarter and more skilled, which is very li- unlikely, they're probably com- they're probably comparable to each other. It doesn't matter if the- he has those things, because he. Okay. War Machine is much faster, and he has so much fucking firepower right behind him. He's, he's like. His power output and his durability is just off the charts. It's like comparing a fucking water gun to a, a RPG at this point. That's like that's actually that's actually giving me a good like. I don't know. It's just like this is like comics are just stupid. And I if we're gonna do going with it's a death death death. What the hell is wrong with me today? Death battle standards. It's probably they're probably gonna weaken uh. War Machine, mainly because of the fact they weakened so many characters from Marvel. I don't get it. Like, I don't know. They just, they just, they just say, like, ah, yeah, this was fucking weak. 
like Thor at planetary and like uh, I don't know who knows yeah so my prediction is going a war machine I don't even know why you guys I don't know why people watch shit <laughs> apparently I don't know but yeah war machine beats I I assume war machine's gonna win and yeah it's like I was planning to talk about the other I was talk, I was planning to talk about the fight but I just do a quick summary uh, I just uh research pretty good it was all right it's not it's nothing impressive but it was all right they they scaled Leonardo to other uh, other Leonardos which is kind of weird but they they were trying to go for the instead of co- uh, compositing all their best feats they he just get they just did find the average for each one which is I mean honestly that's all right but eh, they should they should have focused on one character uh, they should have focused on one Leonardo cuz shit because that would make that would make more sense and the for the research for the for <clears throat> for the Red Ranger, it was all right, but like they could have done better. But uh, they didn't put the Zord or Leonardo's transformation, which was very down. But other than that, his but the animation, holy crap! Okay, just the two D sprite, the sprites were good. I, I I enjoyed the sprite, but in the beginning, like they sh- they show uh, Jason fucking running down the street and he looks so like and they put 2d animation it was like looks so janky it was just ugh, it was like he was like oh i don't even know how to compare that to anything else so yeah i don't know it was, this is a weird episode i don't know what i'm doing so yeah that's my thing um uh, hopefully you guys you could um have enjoyed it um smash smash a like smash the like if you enjoyed it or smash the dislike if you disliked the video probably did a lot of dislikes i mean that makes sense i'm stupid but if you want to see more of this uh subscribe click notifications if you want to but you're not forced to it's not like i'm gonna come to your house and pull up a point forty five to into your head to force you <laughs> who does that <laughs> uh whatever uh, so, hope you guys have a fantastic day, and, uh, and, I don't know, just be, be awesome chads.